This company in the UK is putting bacteria to work. It's converting waste from the microorganisms and putting them onto fabrics. You know, when you look at even microbes as a, as a subclass of all living organisms, they make some spectacularly beautiful colors, okay, blues, reds, yellows, greens. And so we're taking some of those and putting them into a specific microorganism that's safe to use and being able to take that microorganism that will then deposit and fix the, the pigment onto the fabric. The company harvests the genes from bacteria that create color in nature, making it safer to recreate different vibrant patterns. The process cuts the use of water for dyeing cloth by almost 90 percent. It's also chemical-free and uses less energy. More work needs to be done to take it from the lab to clothing stores. But for them, it's not just about saving the environment, it's about cutting costs too. You can be environmentally sustainable, but you may not be socially sustainable, or you, your, your process may cost so much nobody's going to adopt it, okay? So when you look at what we do, we're trying to achieve sustainability across all of those sectors. The company is aiming to start selling commercially by next year. It's getting ready to launch industrial trials and has partnered with luxury and sports brands. Many people eat food produced in labs, and soon they'll be wearing clothes grown in the same way. Sharon Ogunleye, TRT World.